This painting fills Vanessa with such a- Oh my god! He's here! <laughs> He's just crying over this toilet paper table. I mean, same man. Guys, I just released a brand new merch drop. A tie-dye hoodie with super cute details, and a tie-dye tee, both in unisex sizing, plus two posters to choose from. And the best part, 100% of net proceeds will be going to a COVID relief fund. Link in the description below, get one before they're gone. How do you do, fellow simmers? So, my first testing viral sims TikTok life hacks video freaking blew up with views. I mean, it even did as good or even better than some of my real life life hack videos. I should have known. Because you guys are gamers. You guys are my sim sisters. And you don't want to know how to life hack your real life. You know what's more important. Life hacking your sims lives. And so I'm coming back today with part two. Okay, so this first one really hit me in real life hard. You'll see why. 3D lashes. Without lashes, with lashes. Oh, this one is a game changer. Okay, for one, these are the eyelashes that I personally use in my Sims game. Even if I try to take all the custom content out and play just vanilla Sims, I still always add these to my game. They make Sims look so much better. And this one hit me hard because I want to clarify something. During this whole quarantine situation, I don't look like this. This is for videos that will live on past quarantine. My normal days lately, I'm looking like a person who hasn't showered in days, changed their clothes in days, done their makeup in days, because I actually am that person. Case in point, I was getting eyelash extensions. I know some of you know that because they make your eyes pop in videos. I mean, you know what I'm talking about, ladies. But because I can't get them refilled anymore, they all fell out and have left me with little stub lashes because they ruin your natural lashes. I have little stub lashes now. <laughs> this is my signal for stub lashes. So I've been putting fake ones on. And thus, this life hack for putting fake ones on your sims. I just want to point that out for all the people that are like, Lauren, you look so pretty, you look so good. I wish I looked that good right now. I don't look like this all the time. This takes much effort and work. Trust me, I look like you guys. <laughs> I'm gonna show you what a big difference this makes in The Sims. Okay, I get this question a lot, so I might as well just quickly show you. Like, how to download and run custom content? You guys realize there's Google at your disposal, right? Just Google it. That's how I learned. But while you're here, I will put the link to these lashes in the description below. But go to the website. They also have awesome hairstyles to look through. But here's the 3D lashes. If you look on the website, there's actually two versions and a kid's version. You download the female file, the male file, then go to your documents folder. You'll see an electronic arts folder. Inside that is a Sims 4 folder. And then inside that, I forget if this just shows up a mods folder or if you have to make it. Either way, if it's there, use it. If it's not, make a mods folder. Go into it and drag over the package files that you just downloaded. Here they all are, all the eyelashes and hairstyles. Also just make sure that your Sims game options in the other section has this checked. Enable custom content and mods, check that. Script mods, check that. You're good to go. All right, and I'm gonna show you on this random sim with really scary eyebrows, what a difference it makes without custom content eyelashes, with custom content eyelashes. Actually, let's find a better one for you, girl. Ooh, they cute. Okay, with, without, with, without, with, <laughs> without. See? Okay, so last time to make my sim, I did a challenge of trying to recreate like a random anime girl from that generator. If you haven't seen part one, by the way, it's linked in the description. So I decided to make the sim for this episode by doing this art challenge. I think it's time for a new art challenge. I want you to rev up those creative sim fryers, randomize it three times, and recreate the sim you see. Okay. Use whatever artistic skills you want. I have none. You can use colored pencil skills digital skills. She's so good. Oh my Here's god, this is so good. Oh my god, she's so talented. And there, I'm done. <laughs> what? Oh okay, my god. now your turn. Uh, I, I apologize in advance for how badly this is gonna hurt your eyes. She said to use any artistic ability you want and include a digital in there. So we're gonna do some digital painting so you guys can see the process. But basically I'm gonna randomize my sim three times and whatever I end up with, uh, you know, that's, uh, that's what I'm gonna make. Good luck to this sim. Okay, so now we need to make our sim. Ooh, I didn't realize randomize from gallery was here. That's what the girl used in the TikTok. I'm gonna try it. All right, so three times of whatever sim we get, uh, we have to draw and use for the rest of this video. So, okay, ready? One, two, three. <gasps> oh, she cute. It's freaking Vanessa Hudgens. <laughs> 
I got Vanessa Hudgens from the gallery. All right, girl. The only thing I will change though, I'm gonna give you those eyelashes we just downloaded. There we go. Yay. I like your smoky eye, girl. All right, she got her eyelashes. I'm super jealous of her body. <laughs> but I think we're good to go. I gotta draw her now. Oh God. Oh my God, look at this fancy art setup. Okay, you guys ready to see some real artistic talent? Also, while you're watching this, just keep in mind that uh, I'm using a mouse right now, not a pencil. Not that that would matter, but still. Okay, here's her neck. <laughs> kind of drew her off center, but it's fine. Actually, I should do like slightly lighter inside. Oh, there we go. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> Why is her neck so tall? It's fine. All right, so she's got like, it's too, th too thick. <laughs> I can't believe how bad this is. I mean, I can, I can believe how bad this is. I swear I can draw better than this. Okay, she's just got like a ponytail that comes back. Okay, that's her ponytail coming, you know, behind her. Her ears. She kind of looks like Laura Croft. <laughs> okay, <laughs> this is gonna make or break it. The face. I mean, this is not looking as terrible as I had anticipated. I am artist! Yes! Those beautiful, beautiful custom lashes. Look at our final. Wow! <laughs> Yay me! I did a good job. She kind of looks like Laura Croft a little bit in this. All right, this isn't so much of a life hack as a more different way to go about uh, killing Sims for fun. So I never thought to do this to my welcome wagon. And I also never thought to do it with a glass see-through fence so that my Sim can watch like this and enjoy herself. So yeah, we're gonna trap all of my welcome wagon neighbors into a pool with a glass. And life hack, easy way to collect a bunch of Sims at once in your pool. <laughs> All right, so I, Vanessa Hudgens, am now uh, living on my own. I'm totally single. I live across the street from, you know, the two Sims I made in the life hack video number one. There's their car. Where's the welcome wagon? Of course she's doing push-ups in the middle of the sidewalk. Where's the welcome wagon? I'm waiting. Oh, I don't have a pool. Hold on. Where's the welcome wagon? I have my pool. Okay, so it's been three sim days and there's been no welcome wagon. People don't give a crap that I moved into their neighborhood. So I have slowly started befriending people that have walked by my house and I'm gonna invite them over to a pool party. Usually welcome wagons are so inconvenient and annoying, but the one time I want them, they don't happen, which has fueled my hatred of this whole neighborhood. Thus, I'm gonna plan a pool party. Oh, can I not throw a pool party? I thought I could. Trying to lure everybody to come into the pool. Come on, you guys all know you wanna come in. Yes, yes, everybody come on. Oh my God, yes. Get out, get out, Lauren, get out. Why are we all swimming in laps together? Lauren, get out of the pool. Okay, yes, yes. Yes! Ha 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 ha. I created my own welcome wagon. All right, now we need this. Ooh. And now my character's gonna relax here and watch them all suffer because nobody cared she moved to the neighborhood. There we go. Wow. Look at them. They still don't know what's happening yet. They still don't know. <laughs> Yeah, usually I always put walls up. This is much more convenient. My sim can watch. Okay, so this one's kind of a crossover of an IRL life hack mixed with a sims life hack. So like you guys, I'm running out of toilet paper. However, in the sims, you can give them tons of toilet paper. So yeah, I need to hunt down this custom content and fill my sims house with it so I feel good about it in real life. Oh my God, look at all this toilet paper. I'm just gonna put as much toilet paper as I can. We're hoarding all of it so that in real life, I can feel like I have it, even though I don't. We're just gonna put it all in the 
bathroom, put it in my bedroom so we can stare at it before we go to sleep at night. Oh my God, guys, I'm making a toilet paper mountain. Yes, sweet. Look at this. All right, that's good enough. Literally on every surface that we got like a little pile and a big mountain. Perfect. Way more than I've ever had. Okay, so last time we tried the life hack of how to get a girl in The Sims 4. This one is how to get triplets in The Sims 4. I hope this is real. <laughs> Step one, get pregnant. Okay. Step two, listen to jazz music, go fishing, and then eat animal crackers? You have to have the babies at home. And she, she had triplets. What? This always works for me. Okay. All right. We trying to get triplets. All right. Well, while we wait for these Sims to perish, and being that these toilet paper rolls are total guy magnets, I gotta try and get pregnant. And perfect. Today is love day. Hmm. Probably should have saved one of the guys instead of putting them all into the pool, but it's okay. Oh, <gasps> perfect! You found Namaste. one! Oh, he's perfect. Please. Yes, it should be easier to fall in love because it's love day. Yeah, oh, crap. Never mind. Crap, we learned he's married! No! Uh, well, too bad. Adding you to my family. You can't escape. Stop trying to go to work. He was trying to run away from me, so I just had to add him to my family so that he can't escape me, and we are gonna make triplets together and live in our toilet paper kingdom, okay? Oh my god. I mean, I'm hot. I'm Vanessa Hudgens. <laughs> You're hot. We we should make some babies. Why are there dressed up ladies in my house? Get out of here. I told you, these toilet paper rolls are babe magnets. Wait a second. Is his wife her? No. Okay, good. His wife's just randomly gonna show up here. <laughs> I love that they're sitting at a table filled with toilet paper. What is 2020, guys? Seriously? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the heck? Oh, there you are. What was that? Ooh, now this is going well. Oh my God, his wife. Time to widen your palate and your cookbook. Let's sample some food. Uh, nah, Lillian. I've been kidnapped against my will. I missed work. I apparently live here now. And this crazy lady wants to have triplets with me. I keep hearing talking and I'm like, what is that? <laughs> I forget that. <laughs> Oh no! I know they're not dead, they're just floating, but still. <laughs> okay, it's working. It's getting there. This is taking forever. Yes! Now get pregante! Okay, she is getting pregante. Pregurdenant. <gasps> she pregnant! Okay, we have to do uh, all the things they told us to do. Okay, so listen to jazz. Okay, jazz is playing and she's listening to it over here. Let's keep letting her listen to it till she's done. Okay, and then there's a fishing. Oh! <gasps> yes! Yes! You interrupted my fishing! Slash triplet making. Oh, they're all go. They're all going. It's all happening. Good. We gotta make room. There's triplets coming. All right, let's go fishing. I listened to jazz. And now I'm fishing. Don't mind the people crying in the background. It's fine. I'm gonna have triplets. Don't mind the people crying behind me. Wow, the only people alive are the women. Oh wait, never mind. I jinxed it. <laughs> I jinxed it. My bad. Okay, it's all over. It's all over. All right, now I eat some animal crackers whenever I'm done fishing. Oh no, what a tragedy. How did nobody stop this, even though you could see exactly what was happening through the glass the entire time and probably could have heard them screaming for help. But all you guys were too busy. This is your fault, not mine. All right, time to eat some animal crackers. She's sadly eating these animal crackers. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be okay. Oh my God, there's so much crying outside. Can you keep it down? I'm pregnant, okay? I need quiet. All right, we'll move on to some other TikToks while we're waiting for her to have the babies. Okay, this one blew my mind. I don't know if it's real. So you get a sink and then keep washing your hands until it breaks and you get water on the ground. Now go into build mode, click design tool or R, click the puddle and on the fourth option, what? It turns into a freaking puddle duck? I have to try it. I've never seen or heard about this ever. Okay, so while we've been waiting for her to have the babies, I had them break this sink by washing their hands in it as many times as possible. Also very relatable to the state of the world. And I think this is the size of the puddle that they said I needed. I'm ready to have my mind blown. Let's see. Okay, so it's just going to build mode and then press R. No freaking way. No freaking way. Oh my god! It even has an eye. Did you guys know about this? I had no idea. What? 
How did I not know? This is ridiculous. I'm leaving it. I will repair that though, because that's gonna drive me crazy. Okay, so some of you guys might know about this, but I completely forgot about it. Even though it was my favorite thing to do in The Sims 1, you can summon the tragic clown. And I feel like some people, there was a lot, there was almost 10,000 likes on this. So I feel like some simmers either don't know about this or completely forgot about it like me. So life hack, if you want a sad clown in your life, just keep crying at the photo. We're gonna try it because I haven't done it ever. Have I? I had to have done this at some point, maybe a long time ago. Okay, so look at this beautiful painting. Stare at it, stare at it. Basically we need to keep staring at it until he shows up. Oh, she getting more pregante? This painting fills Vanessa with such a- Oh my God, he's here! <laughs> that was the quickest. I thought you are supposed to like keep looking at it for an extended period of time. Maybe because she was so sad about those people that drowned in the pool mysteriously. Yeah, maybe because they were already sad. It summoned him much quicker. Uh, hey, tragic clown. What's up? Welcome to our home. Did you see the duck puddle? It's pretty epic. He's just crying over this toilet paper table. I mean, same man. This year's been rough. He's married? Is that a wedding ring? Who are you married to? Sorry. I told him I was pregnant and he started crying. Hates children. Well, there you go. All right, have the babies. I need to see if this worked. Oh my God, yes, gone into labor. Yes, I am so excited to see if this actually works. If it does, what? Okay, there was no room in the apartment for all three. So we're gonna pick have baby at home. Okay, let's see. Triplets! TikTok, don't steer me wrong. Also, by the way, once again, from the front, like you can't even tell she's pregnant. But then from the side, oh yeah. <gasps> okay, this is Skylar. That was it! I literally listened to Jazz and went fishing and ate animal crackers in that order every single trimester, just to be safe, even though they didn't tell me that. I did it every trimester and she still only had one baby debunked not true damn you tiktok i mean unless i did something wrong but or one of the mods interfered but look how sad this is i have two empty bassinets because of tiktok and now i gotta deal with a crying baby because of tiktok thanks well that's gonna be it for sims tiktok life hacks for every like this video gets this baby will stop crying please please help me this is very very annoying. Also subscribe if you're new to the channel and hit that notification bell so you don't get lost in the void that is now YouTube. And as always, I will see you guys soon. Stop crying. I mean, we could have had crying times three. So I guess, I guess I'm kind of lucky in that way. Thanks TikTok.